It is not the normal process that we would take to uh, take up matters such as this, and this is a significant matter. But um, only recently have we learned of the governor's proposed legislation, and of course, as Ms. Sebastian indicated, the legislature will begin its work, as I understand it, next week. They're already meeting, uh, not as a legislature, but as groups and regions. Mr. Noe, chairman of the MBTA, and I spoke today, and we spoke about this resolution, which provides uh, assistance to him as chairman of the MBTA uh, in order to um, provide uh, support for him in his efforts in front of the legislature and its uh, groups, including the Northern Virginia legislature, Legislative uh, uh, Group, uh, to understand what the governor's um, proposals meant and the impact associated with what uh, the governor proposed and potential solutions to it. Is there a, a reason since the legislation is not even started as of today that this cannot wait till our next meeting so we have some time to review this, this document? Yes, there is. And in fact, as I mentioned, Mr. Noe, uh, as chairman of the MBTA and as a, uh, a voting member of the Board of the County Supervisor for Prince William, another non-metro jurisdiction, as well as um, uh, Ms. Rochelle of Manassas Park support the resolution, and um, he will be meeting with the legislative, the Northern Virginia legislative delegation <coughs> on that. I'm sure it will be the subject of much discussion on Wednesday. Uh, but to take a position before we fully understand, uh, I think stacks of uh, ready firing, um, and I would oppose such and suggest to uh, my council members that we not, you know, if, if we need to do this in two weeks, we can do it in two weeks. Uh, there's not even any legislation done in two weeks. It's my belief, and you've heard me speak to this before, that the MBTA has a, um, it, it has Bill 2313, and the introduction of uh, the result of that and the work of the MBTA since 2013, as I remember, has put the MBTA in a position that it can substantially um, impact congestion in Northern Virginia. And for the first time ever, uh...